Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me the new Amazon Kindle Scribe and it comes with Amazon Premium Pen. So in this video, I am going to talk about PDF annotations on this Kindle. So guys, here I have one PDF file. I will just open it. So once you open it, you will see on your left side, you have all the tools available. So the first tool is the pen tool. So you can write on your pdf as well with this pen tool okay the writing experience is really amazing it is really smooth okay so it feels like i am writing on paper and even if i try to write fast so you can see so everything is going very well okay and the palm rejection is also working perfectly fine if i put my palm okay and i try to write you can see there is no marks over here the next thing is this pen tool comes with the uh, different thickness option so you can see you have different thickness so you can make it heavy okay so then if you write it will look like this okay the next thing is the highlighter tool so if you want to use the highlighter tool you can highlight anything on your pdf file so you can highlight it okay the next thing is there are different thickness option in the highlighters as well so we have medium thin thick fine so different options available in the highlighter the next tool is the eraser tool so if you uh, write something on uh, your PDF okay so for example if I write something so you can use the eraser tool okay so if for example you can select the eraser tool you have different option for example I select it so you can see you can easily erase anything okay the next thing that I want to mention again if you select this eraser tool you also have rub out selection so you just select it and then you can simply select any part that you want to erase like this and it will erase it for you the next thing that I want to mention here is if you select on top like this if you just tap it okay so you will see a new menu will appear on top okay so if for example you want to see your annotated work all your annotated work if you want to see it you select this book icon over here okay you just select it so once you select it here it will take you to the page where you have all your annotated work okay so you can see you just scroll up and you can see all your annotated work is now saved over here okay so the next thing is if you want to share only this annotated work you can share it by just selecting this share icon and you can send it you can share it via email okay the next thing that i want to mention over here if you want to bookmark any page in your pdf so here is the bookmark option you just select it okay select this plus sign and it will bookmark it for you the next thing is about sharing all your pdf okay everything uh, in your pdf you can share it okay so you just select on top and then you have this share icon you can select you can share it via email okay uh, the next tool is these three dots so for example if i select these three dots if you want to hide the stylus toolbar you can just select it you can see the toolbar is now hidden okay so there is no toolbar over here okay so you can see you can just open it you can just read it okay so you can see and then the next thing is if you want to enable the uh, toolbar just select these three dot show stylus toolbar so the toolbar appear over here so if we're talking about the toolbar you can change its position as well you select these three dots you can move it to the right side like this or you can move it again to the left side if you want to make it small this toolbar select this arrow on top so it will be like this only a small icon appear on the top if you select it it will open the whole toolbar for you so guys if you want to move to the next page you can select it you can just swipe it like this and it will take you to the next page there is one more thing that you can do is you can just select on top okay there are two there are icon appear on the bottom so for example if i select this icon over here so you can see it will open a new page and behind that i have the uh, the main page okay so if you want to scroll from here you can directly scroll scroll from here and you can directly go to that specific page so for example again i select it okay so you can see i can just scroll it 
okay so for example if i go to the end of the page i just scroll it so it will be very fast for me okay so i just select page 31 of 38 and i want to select this page i can just select it directly from here so it will be really fast and easily accessible for me to move to any page the next tip that i want to mention here is if you want to zoom in or zoom out you can just use your two finger for example i just move it like this and it will become bigger okay so you can see now it will become bigger and then if you want to make them small you can also make it small like this uh, the next tip is about uh, once you finish your work it will automatically save so this pdf file this annotated pdf file will save automatically so guys this is for today's video i hope you like the video i hope you enjoy the video so please subscribe to my channel thank you very much